Hey guys, Mason here and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing y'all some tips and tricks for washing simulator. Let's get right into this. So basically, whenever you're starting off, go ahead and finish the tutorial and stuff. Just quickly do that. And then once you're done with the tutorial, go in here and click build and remove this and go ahead and put it on the edge because over here, you know, Whenever you collect dishes, you don't have to run all the way back over here to put it in. Instead, you can just grab them and instantly put them in and like grab more. So yeah, it's better to have them closer to you than all the way back here. Whenever you do that, whenever you start getting more and more, you can just, um, hold on, where's one? You can just like start putting them like this, just like this, then behind, and yeah, whatever. So that's how I do it instead of like having to run all the way back here. Some people like put them around and stuff. Also, so whenever you go into a game, I recommend trying to get this spot right here or that one over there. Just try to get one of the spots closest to the bin. Because over by the bin, like you walk pretty slow in this game. So over here, you can just grab dishes, toss them in here. Once they're done, you can just turn toss them in here and repeat so if you're on this plot all the way over here that is gonna be very very tough and it's just gonna take a lot longer but yeah so I recommend trying to get one of those two plots either this one or this one these other ones like right here and right there are fine but these four over here are just bad so yeah but if you're trying every single server you can and you just can't get one of these that's fine. I just recommend using the conveyor to help you get over here faster. You can toss them in, and then you can go ahead and use the conveyor to get back. Just like this. But yeah, you don't need to use the conveyor at all if you're on one of these plots. Because there's no reason to go over here at all. And if you want to go to the shop, you can just do it like that. Over here at the shop, I recommend buying dishwashers more than baskets. I recommend only buying baskets whenever you start getting so much money. Like, over here you'll start getting like a thousand or whatever. So I, I recommend buying these whenever you start getting tons of money. Like, I don't, I forgot how much these cost. But yeah, so this one for example. I, I just went ahead and skipped this one and have this one. So yeah, this one, I recommend buying this whenever you start getting like tens and hundreds of thousands not hundreds of thousands just tens of thousands so like um this one no this one right here these two whenever you start like constantly being able to buy these then i recommend buying like this galaxy one and then you can just keep going from there but these ones these ones you can like only afford after you buy like tons of these ones right here so yeah, I recommend just filling up your plot with these ones and then trying to save up for like this gold one and stuff right here. So whenever you start getting these double ones right here, you might realize that you might not be able to put them like close together. And let me show you. So whenever you place them like this, you can place that one, but you realize you can't place one behind you. So you have to skip a row, but that wastes like a whole row. So what you can do, you can remove them. And if you rotate them just like this, then you can place them behind each other and beside each other. So you waste no space at all and you can just completely fill up your whole plot with them. Because yeah, if you have it this way, then you end up having to skip a space. And that just like wastes a whole row, which you can't place anything. And you can't even place these ones. Oh, well, I guess you can. But yeah. But these ones aren't as good as like this magma, not this one, these magma ones. So yeah, I just recommend filling up your whole pot with these magma ones right here. Another thing, just like laundry simulator, I recommend using an auto clicker to grab these. See, let's go ahead and place them down. So I have mine just like this. This is how I like to lay them out. Just like this. And I don't have too much washing machines at once. So if you have like tons of these, don't fill up your whole plot just with one. Because then like by the time you fill up like five of them, the 
first one's already going to be done, and there's no reason to fill up the rest. So yeah, let's go over here. He's an auto clicker. You can easily grab these just like this. Super easy using an auto clicker. Then you don't have to turn it off. You can just toss them in. Continue grabbing them. Toss them in. You don't have to turn it off at all. See, so once they're done, you can just like hover over them, grab them, toss them in just like this. So yeah. Also, what tons of people do, they run in this green circle right here. You don't have to run in there. You can click it from far away. You can't click from like super far. But like this distance, you don't even have to run in there. You can just click it and it saves lots of time. For the dishwashers, I recommend only buying a few of them. Like don't buy tons and tons of them. Like so for these ones, you can buy like... Um, no, I skipped this one. I didn't buy any of these. I went ahead and bought one of these. Then I bought like two of these, two of these, then like three, 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 then like two, and so on. But over here, I started buying like four and five of these. So yeah, that's just what I did. Y'all can do it however you want. Also, be careful with the laundry machines because I'm pretty sure there's a glitch. Like, if you leave the game, sometimes whenever you rejoin, your laundry machine won't be there. See, that happened to me. So I was grinding. I had all of these. I got to like um these two over here. Then I left the game and then I rejoined. And these galaxy ones from my inventory were gone. Which was very strange. Because like I left the game before, like multiple times before. And these were still in my inventory. But then just at one time I left and rejoined and they were gone. And I don't believe you can, like, actually delete anything. Like, permanently delete it. So, I have no idea how or where they went. So, yeah, they're just gone forever. And I think some other ones might have been disappearing. I don't think so. Because I can't really see any other ones. I think I had two of these cheese ones. I don't know, but just some laundry machines have been disappearing, so be careful about that. And yeah, that is going to be all for today, so make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, and I'll see y'all in the next video.